Hey everyone, today I'm going to be doing another video. This time this reviews, this time this video isn't going to do of any review. I'm kind of too tired to do a review and I've been quite busy. Um so yeah, this the reason why I haven't been posting in a while is because I've been quite busy and I got a figure haul here. I can't show it off cuz YouTube doesn't let me record to for, to more than 15 minutes. So Sorry, but we're going to have to show off just the figures here. Sorry I can't show off the haul. I don't know why YouTube isn't le letting me record till like 15.30, but whatever. But yeah, I've been quite busy. So yeah, I kind of apologize that I haven't been recording in a while. My newest videos that I, that I recorded were the was, was the review of the Arnold and then the Lost Armor Predator and then and then the Ahab Predator um, Ultimate Figure. Which I did a review of. So yeah, without further ado, let's just get into this fig into the figures. So YouTube doesn't cut me cut me off all of a sudden. So as you can see in front here, we got a NECA AVP 2015 Scar Predator figure, which I'm kind of surprised and kind of um and kind of um glad that I that I came across this guy. Um, the the NECA AVP um Predator figures are from like 2015, and I just barely found this guy at a comic shop in 2020. And he actually came with opposite feet, but the the packaging was sealed, like it was sealed, like this hasn't this figure wasn't open in a long time, and it had opposite feet. And I'm thinking, so could could someone um uh, could someone um swap the feet out from not, from another Predator and put it on Scar and, and glue it back together, but no, I'm guessing the factory made a mistake, and this figure's been in the package for a lo for a long time, from 2015 all the way to here till 2020. But yeah, I had to take off my Celtic Predator's armored foot to put it on on Scar. So he came with an armored foot showing his toes, and um, he came with an armored foot, um, which the armor is on top of his toes, and then he came with a bare foot that's showing his. His toes, but it doesn't have any armor on his to on his feet whatsoever. So yeah, but there's that figure, and then here's a Resurrection Xenomorph, um, from Alien Resurrection, of course, which is a good figure except for the except for the knees and the shins. The shin the knees and the shins are kind of bad. It's not extremely bad right now, but over time it's gonna get really really loose. I already had some. I I had some Resurrection aliens that I had really loose shins. And really um, loose kneecaps. But yeah. It's a good figure. But the legs are kind of bad. Then two aliens. Like Xenomorph Warriors. Um, here's the, um, the brown one. And then and here's the brown metallic one. Which I reviewed on the channel. Along with the blue metallic dark colored alien warrior. So there's the brown. Here's two brown ones. One right there. And then one right here. And then a bunch of alien eggs. Like back here. And in front here. Scar and then his cheap tech deck and his and then this cheap tech deck trash can, um. So yeah, it might be weird. I have little trash cans for little diorama piece um trash cans, but I like to use them as explosive, dangerous barrels that you have to be careful not to blow up, like not to accidentally shoot. But yeah, here's explosive barrels. I li I like to use them as explosive barrels, which they're pretty good for. So yeah, little cheap tech deck, which is a great diorama piece. So yeah, and then little chest burster here, and two face huggers crawling. There's that one back there, and then this guy in front. So chest burster over here, and a bunch of alien eggs here. There's one right there, and then there's a dead dog alien, on um, which which the alien bursted out of its stomach like an alien three. So yeah, an alien the assembly cut it bursted out of an ox, and the regular cut it bursted out of the dog. But yeah, then here's a face hugger coming out of the alien egg. Right there, there's at least like four alien eggs on camera. Well, five. That that one right there, and then that, and then uh, that one back there, and then that one, and then that one, and then that one. There's quite a bit of alien eggs here in frame, but yeah. Then here's the um, then here's the blue alien warrior, which I think is awesome. I give it a nine out of ten. The reason why I give it a nine out of ten is because it lacks articulation in the shoulder slash bicep. Literally doesn't have any biceps nor slash shoulder articulation whatsoever. The old one does. Like the like Genocide Red Alien has a nice shoulder articulation, but this guy doesn't. It's still a great mold. I'm still gonna continue army building that guy. But yeah, it's kind of a shame it has no um shoulder articulation. Then here's the albino big shot from 2015, 
not the 40th anniversary one from last year, 2019. Then more alien eggs here. A red genocide warrior sneaking up on a black genocide warrior. Resurrection Xeno over here. Snake and a bunch of alien eggs around Snake Predator. So yeah, I can't wait for the ultimate release. And then here's a black genocide alien warrior. And then a little a tiny um, blue face hugger. That, which came with the gorilla alien. You can see him right there. And another dog with the chest burster um, exploding out over there. Dead dog. So, yep. And then... More Wretched Head um, Aliens 86 Warriors right here. So you yeah, have the black ones and then the brown ones and the blue ones. And then the reissue of the Fugitive Predator. I personally think that reissue of the Fugitive Predator is far better than the last one. So yeah. And uh, more Resurrection Aliens and the little chest burster back there. Looks good. And then uh, and the Wailing Yutani Hallways here. A resurrection alien over here, and then another Xeno from Resurrection right there, and then the Elder Predator from AVP right there, and a little stasis tube with the face hugger inside there, and a little face hugger crawling on top. More alien eggs, a genocide and a red alien fighting each each other right there, a blue ultimate alien warrior, a mid cloaked falconer predator and a tracker predator, and then. And then a uh, resurrection alien over here. More eighty six alien. More eighty six Xeno warriors right here. A couple blue ones, a couple brown ones, and mostly blue ones over there in the back. And then brown ones over here. The resurrection one, which I already showed. And then the predators twenty ten hellhound by NECA. More alien eggs, and two explosive barrels. And then a little Kenner red face hugger. I don't think you see him, but yeah. And then there's a queen burster, another blue aliens warrior. And then a defiance egg morphing xenomorph. So yeah, the reason why I say it's a, it's a egg morphing xenomorph is because in the first alien movie, you, you can see the big trap, and um, you can see Dallas turning into an alien egg. I forgot which which cut of the movie has that though. There's different cuts in the movie, of course. But there's the defiance alien. It's cool. It's a cool figure. Then the little flame effects there. And then the dog alien, NECA, the, the NECA NES Alien 3 dog alien. And then all the alien warriors I showed you here. Then more alien warriors back there. And then a genocide red big ship. A blue warrior sneaking up on it. And the little face huggers, two little face huggers and chest bursts back there. And another alien egg, more resurrection Xenos. And then the big genocide red queen mother by NECA, which is cool as well. And then Snake right there, which I showed you. More alien warriors here, and then the dog alien. And the ancient warrior, which is, I mean, not the ancient, the young blood, which is basically Scar, but with a little bit of shiny armor and a little bit different parts. Then the NECA Ultimate Lost Armor Predator, which is a ten, solid 10 out of 10 for me. So I really enjoyed the figure. And then uh, an albino big chap. And then the alien warriors over here. And yeah, let's go to this side over here. Here is the here are some blue aliens, Xeno warriors, uh, Xenomorphs. There's one right there, and then a, and then three over here. This one's crawling on all fours, and then these two are standing up. Couple alien eggs over here, Resurrection warrior, Emissary predator right there, which is awesome, and then a broken decapitated a AVP alien warrior head, which is actually from a broken AVP spear that came with the young blood. I'm kind of sad that that spear broke, but I could use that alien has as a de as a de decapitated head now. Then here's a, de a broken decapitated resurrection head, uh, right there next to a flame effect piece, laser shot, and then an extra mad predator. I attached a bad blood shoulder armor right there, uh, um, alpha predator's biomass, plasma caster, and smart disc from Predator Two, from the Demon City Hunter. And then more genocide aliens right here, the black one and the red one. More blue warriors, and then one right there. NECA Chrysalis Alien from the AVP 1991 game. And then Razor Claws. Two rhinos, one pred alien, another queen burster. And then Ahab right there, which is an awesome figure, I reviewed him as well. Two alien warriors there, and then an alien egg right there. And the newborn from Resurrection. And Latticecape Fugitive with the with my old NECA Armored Lost Predator's armor and the Jungle Hunter mask so he can look different. 
some different weapons. Then some arach then an arachnid alien from the nineteen ninety one AVP game. Match Predator, two um aliens, warriors right there, emissary, and then the rhino alien right there, it's just ri random rhino alien. Then my second chrysalis alien running on all fours, three resurrection wounds ba back here, elder, and then another resurrection alien getting his throat slit, and then a Bambi burster, um slash uh slash alien three dog burster. So yeah, I'm most. Most people call it a Bambi Burster, which it is, but, yeah. Then some Aliens Warriors. Here's one right there, and then one right here, which they're both the re-release from, like, 2013. They're both the old release of the Alien of the Blue Warrior from 2013. Look, I'm, I'm glad I have two of them. It's a great sculpt, and it actually has articulation in the shoulders, unlike the Ultimate one. So, yeah. Then the Warrior Predator from AVP 1991. And then Torn in Half, Severed Bishop here. Big Shep, can attribute um Hive Wars Predator if I remember remember his name. Resurrection, Snake Alien, then the Scorpion Alien, and then the can attribute Blue Big Shep. One alien warrior, um about to tackle the red genocide dog alien. The big regular queen alien right there. Jungle Hunter fighting a brown warrior and shaman fighting the blue warrior. And then four blue warriors right here, and then the domed head gray. Gray, silver mixed with black, domed head warrior. Resurrection warrior. And then uh, a choker alien. And then a rigid head warrior. And an isolation alien. And then more hallways and more corridors right here. These are, that, that back there is mostly a hallway while these are corridors. And then these are hallways, which I need to get the corridors to cover this so it doesn't look kind of bad. But here's a city slash ghost. And an ancient warrior predator. Emissary, Emissary 2 Predator, Lava Planet, Co Alien Covenant, Xeno, More Aliens, Warriors, Resurrection Alien, Apalm, and then the Blown Apart, Xenomorph right there. The 30th Anniversary, 40, I mean not 30th, the 40th Wave, um, Albino Big Shop, the regular Big Shop, uh, an, extra fu the, the old, an Extra Fugitive Old Release, that I, that I attached some different predator parts so he doesn't look like a fugitive. He looks different. And then the predator that helped um, Michiko Noguchi slash Broken Tusk. And then Enforcer right there, which is the cop of the comics. Then an alien egg right there. And Stalker, Drake, and Burke. So, yeah, that's basically it. I already showed all of that. So, yeah, if you liked the video, like, comment, subscribe if you liked the video. Or leave a fat dislike. I really don't care. But I hope you found this video enjoyable. And see you in the next one.